for the music in the show, I wanted to play in the gallery uh, the album, The Songs for Pierre Chauvin by The Mountain Goats. Uh, here's some of it. It's an album that came out in uh, March of 2020, and it's a, a guy in a guitar, just an acoustic guitar, uh, recorded on an old Panasonic boombox, you know, where you have to hit down the record and play at the same time. Uh, he made a whole album during the pandemic on an old boombox, and decided to do an album about, the from the point of view of the pagans, when the Christians came to Constantinople and the displacement of the pagans by the Christians. Um, and this conflict between having like one god versus many gods, or oracles versus prophecies. Um, uh, so there's a lot about, uh, yeah, the, this conflict that happens in the city. And, sorry, it's a, uh, I think the music was out of my studio a lot and got me thinking, it's only 33 minutes long, you can listen to the whole album and then it repeats itself. So like you wind up listening to it, if you're not really paying attention, you'll listen to it three or four times without even knowing you're, you're hearing it. Um, all of these paintings are painted with this album on in the background. I've been stuck on the same album for about, two albums for about a year, uh, Run the Jewels 4 and <laughs> this album by the Mountain Goats have kind of taken over my world. And so I wanted to uh, just in the gallery space have the music that was I was listening to when I made all these. And I think so many of the titles, so many of the ideas uh, that are themes in the actual paintings are also themes that are dealt with in the album. Um, I don't know, it's kind of always a transmutation, transmosis thing where, you know, inputs and then what comes out. Uh, so I thought I would kind of aid the atmosphere and aid the uh, paintings to be able to hear a little mountain goats in the background. That's it. There it is. <laughs> 